Let's talk about some of the things we take to help us sleep. Now, I know a lot of people with migraine like to talk about melatonin. So let's start with that. Do you think it can be helpful? So melatonin, there have been studies showing that melatonin three milligrams have been helpful for migraine prevention mm -hmm. in addition to potentially helping with sleep. But I think we really have to say that melatonin is not a sleep aid. And I okay. think this is the biggest point I want to drive home is that melatonin is our body's natural sleep hormone. It is not meant to help us get groggy to fall asleep. So okay. it helps regulate our circadian rhythm, which is our natural sleep wake cycle. So the role of melatonin really is for phase shifts. For example, jet lag when you're changing time zones and you want to re-regulate your cycle mm -hmm. to the new time zone. It is for people who, let's say, their natural body wants to go to sleep at 3 a.m., but life is telling me I have to go to bed at 11, 11 p.m. We mm -hmm. use it to phase shift back their sleep to a more acceptable um, pattern. But it is not really meant to be a sleep aid. Sure, taking it in the moment might make you feel a little bit groggy, but it is really not, not a sleep aid. So I just want to put it that it's fine to take, but at the same time, it's not something that we should be dependent on to make us go to sleep.